I think he just won the game. I think Oxerg is gonna win the game. Now he still can't see the Cloak Wraiths, which actually have a ton of energy. Uh oh, uh oh, this could be huge! He could lose a lot of mutas right there! The Wraiths is gonna be cloaked forever with all their energy! Oh no, Oxerg! Oxerg getting a little bit over aggressive. Gonna lose a lot of mutas. He's got three mutas remaining. They're gonna finally escape home. But look at all those extra mutas in production. Is he getting any air upgrades? No air upgrades. And the expansion command center is finally down for TTF. He's gonna have to get some extra turrets up here though. Uh, meanwhile, Oxerg is taking the third at the bottom right. It's actually ahead of the command center. So Oxerg is now in a commanding position. He's now getting the overlord speed upgrade. I think he actually needs this to finish before he can really do any kind of serious uh, attack because of all these cloaked wraiths, but actually the wraiths did uncloak, and uh-oh, uh, he's gonna try and do some micro, oh, irradiate, a great irradiate, oh my god, not splitting it out in time, all the mutas taking so much damage, oh man, even flying over a turret, and here come the wraiths, the wraiths, I think I'm gonna clean this up quite easily, he's gonna try and get the science vessel, can he get it, no, he will not get it, uh, it looks like gonna try and intercept with the marine group, can he get it, he stims, he stims, he's gonna go for it, he's gonna intercept, oh no, getting an extra two mutas and a damage on a third one, so Oxerg, wow, this game is just so back and forth right now, I have no idea. I actually have no idea who's ahead. And the server's going to shut down, but I don't care, because it's my last game, and I will stay connected to the game. Whatever, that's what, it, it, I don't know. So, uh, wow, we still have, the Wraiths have mostly survived, uh, thanks in large part to their cloaking. Uh, Comsec goes down, sees the expansion, is he going to go for that, and oh no, let's see the Wraiths cloak once again, get a couple of, no, only one free Muta. But, uh, oh man, Overlord Speed is not done yet. Oh, it's so close to finishing. He really needs that to, uh, to deal with these Cloak Wraiths. Although I think the energy on those Wraiths should be uh, almost out. They've been cloaking uh, quite a bit now. Yeah, most of the Wraiths are out of energy. And they're going to intercept here. Now, there's no more cloaking for them. So it's just going to be pure Wraiths against Mutas. And the Overlord even comes in. So, oh no, a huge blunder by TTF. Losing a lot of his Wraiths. But he is going to take down the third base here. So still, I don't know who's ahead. Looks like a couple of Scourge came in from the back. Try and get a Vessel. I think they got one hit. But uh, I, st I still don't know who's ahead right now. Um, a bunch of turrets going up here at the third base. Is that mattering, his uh, refinery? I think it is. Which is not good, considering he's going uh, SK Terran. Well, not really, actually. He's making Siege Tanks, but he's going two-port Vessel. And, ooh, a hidden base at the 6 o'clock. We'll get taken down. A double Irradiate on the Mutalisks. He's going to have to split it twice, but he does get one of the vessels, and he does split the Irradiated Mutas very nice. There's a stamp, but oh no, flying over Marines! No, Oxerg, why did you do that? Oh my god, Oxerg, he had a nice split, but then he just he just ran into Marines. Marines, man, they're pretty good against Mutas. And he's got, he's got his third base tonight so many times, I think he's in a lot of trouble. One Wraith sacrificing itself. And I'm, su I'm a little bit surprised that Oxer decided not to get an uh, air upgrade, given how many mutas he's made. I mean, he's got enough money right now. Um, some random links running in here. I don't know what that's supposed to accomplish. Well, apparently there's like no units in the base, so it's going to accomplish a decent amount. That's cool. Yeah. All right. 20-minute run by. Sick build. Three Marines and SCB. I think that was actually a uh, cost for cost. That works out. But oh no, some free Zerglings here! Although the Marines weren't with the Medics, so uh, he did get a couple. Uh, they are 1-0 Marines. I think it's on upgraded units for the Zerg. Although he's going to get a Vessel here. I don't know how that happened. Whoa! What was that? I don't even know. Now, there are a lot of Sunkens here. So I think he will be able to survive. But the question is, can this base survive? And the answer is probably no. Um, because there are a lot of Medic Marine coming down here. They are coming in single file, though. So if he does some nice micro... Well, he only has four Mutas, so he can't really do anything. Gets the Wraith, he needs to run away! Ah, losing two of the Mutas. Three of the Mutas! And that guy's not going to be too happy. Now, taking another base. Now, Oxer's money is getting really high. He's been losing bases and Mutas left and right, but still with a lot of money in the bank. Whereas TTF's money is uh, getting quite low, but his main is getting mined out, though, so... He's going to be down to only his natural soon enough. And uh, now adding a couple more barracks. This game is just so intense, but here come a lot of Lurkers! There's two Siege Tanks in the back, but there's not many Bio Forces! He's gonna get us around! Can he get it? There's a Raven here! All the Bio goes down, I think! Oh, there's a Muta in the mix, and he will actually clean it up! So Oxerg cleans up the forces once again. Is there anything in that bunker? There is not! Uh, are the Marines actually gonna try and run through? That's... well, 
One Marine did survive. He was a survivor. But usually you don't you don't want to run through lurkers. Man, that was seriously running the gauntlet. <laughs> TTF was just just told the Marines like everybody just go for the bunker. It's fine. Don't worry about it, man. As long as you as long as one of you gets in, it's it's a victory. Uh, I, is T, is TDF Russian? Is kind of he must be a Soviet commander or something like that. I don't know. Oh no, Oxerg, Oxerg, you can't afford this right now. Well, I guess he has a lot of money, so he can't afford it. But you know, don't you don't want to waste their things. And here come the lurkers now. Uh, how is the micro of TTF? Pretty good right there. Uh, meanwhile, TTF though looks like he's trying to inch out slowly to try and take a third. Uh, his main is, yep, essentially mined out now, so he does really want that extra base. Meanwhile, the 12 o'clock is done, it's scanned, there's no defenses finished just yet, but if he if he just sits two or three lurkers right here, he could defend it against a lot of medic marine, but it looks like he, he doesn't have any lurkers there, and he can't afford it, he's all out of gas, and oh my god, here comes an attack! It looks like TTF will get crushed, he does get all the lurkers though, importantly, getting all the gas units, and uh, Oxer, so short on gas, has a lot of minerals though still. But he does now have the third gas up TTF down to essentially this one base. So TTF needs to expand very soon. Oh, or he's going to be in a lot of trouble. And has he actually been upgrading? He's got two engineering bays. Okay, he's about to finish 2-0. Uh, currently at 1-0. Any upgrades for the Zerg? Looks like one carapace has finished and no additional upgrades. But the hive is finished. What is the hive tech going to be? Now, he has almost no gas, so he can't even really afford to file our tech, I guess. And this base is now under attack by a lot of units. Where is the army of Oxerg? It's doing something. He's actually, wow. Was that a, I guess the Hydra got irradiated, so he turned it into a Lurker. That's interesting. And uh, apparently it goes down to 110 health and stops and then heals. Cool. Uh, a bunch of links once again running in. Stim back. Get to the bunker. Get to the bunker. And, oh, it looks like that base has gone down. So... Oxerg is now reduced to uh, three bases, or sorry, two bases, but he is double expanding, and here's a big attack though by Oxerg. I don't know if that's a good idea, there's a bunker here, the bunker is going to be so crucial in the defense, yeah, that was not a good idea, and this one Wraith continuing, that Wraith has 10 kills by the way, and continues to be annoying here, it also has a lot of energy, so can't cloak up if uh, some random muta or something goes to kill it. Oh man, but, but TTF really wants this base though, I think. Uh, wow. Wait, what? Okay, cool. Random medic. She was, uh, apparently it's a loner medic. She just, you know, too cool for the crowd. She's one of the cool kids. And, uh, instead of scanning this, he runs away. But, uh, can definitely go and kill this bottom right base. So, I mean, Oxygen has gotten this base up, but it, it's a mineral only, and he really wants gas right now to, to utilize the hive tech. He actually has gotten no hive buildings. I assume he's gotten the Adrenal Glands upgrade for his Lings, otherwise that Hive is a complete waste. Meanwhile, TTF sitting at a ton of gas in the bank. Uh, and, oh, random Marine gonna kill that drone. And finally taking his third base. He's actually distance mining. Is that on purpose? I think that might be on purpose because his natural is completely saturated. The main is gone. So a bit of distance mining from the third is actually not necessarily a bad thing. Uh, if we look at the food counts now, 92 against 52 for Oxer. Oxer got a huge deficit, and oh man, a scan going down. Marines running in, he might lose his third base yet again. Oxer losing mutas and hatcheries like a wizard. And yep, that is almost something going to go down. The 2-0 Marines going to take it out quite easily. He's actually right-clicked on the hatchery. He does get it. There's the stim. He's going to lose the bioforce. But it doesn't matter. They did their job. And Oxer has a lot of random links on the map. I don't... I don't know what's up with that. Anyway, he wants to get the 12 o'clock up once again. But this is not good. Okay, looks like he's finally got uh, some hype tech up. He's got the defiler mount and getting consume. Uh, rather, consume has just started. But I think with all that expansion denial uh, and with this, this attack might actually decide who wins the game here because Oxer keeps getting losing his third base. He's still on two bases, and here we go. Can TTF hold his mineral only, or will Oxer crush it? Uh, it looks like some nice siege tanks in the back doing a lot of damage here. A lurker doing a lot of damage as well, though. Oxer, Oxer is pushing through. There's a bunker, but it's empty. He's a stim and running to the bunker right now. Oh no, he rallied everything. He didn't fix the rally point. One marine does run into the bunker. SCVs run alongside. Those SCVs, they want to live, man. They don't care about repairing the bunker. They just want to get in the bunker. They want to live. They don't want to die. 
and it looks like TTF has lost the mineral only despite having a very huge food lead. I don't know what it was in. I guess I guess it was actually mostly an SCVs or something. And oh no, TTF not fixing his rally points, losing a few more marines for free. But there was a drop in the main, but it's not doing anything. Oh my god, the mass hydra is a nice focus firing by Oxic on individual marines. And that drop, a double drop in fact, does essentially zero damage. He went for the defiler mount, but he didn't get it. The defiler mount did survive. And Octurk, I think, I think now is in a commanding position right now. He's got Lurkers outside the Terran base. Looks like TTF was trying to switch into uh, Vultures with Mines. Do that mid-game mining up of the map, but it looks like it was a little bit too late. If he had a bunch of Spider Mines up here, that battle would have been a completely different story. And it looks like Lings are going to see this uh, dropship moving out. It actually has no medic in it, only 7 Marines. Now, the 12 o'clock base, though, has no defense. It is completely vulnerable. More drones are transferring. Oxer could lose a lot of drones here, as well as the hatchery. But can TTF hold the main base? Spider Mines are pretty good, though! Spider Mines are pretty good. The bunker has two Marines in it. More units coming out. The tank is sieging up. He needs to repair the bunker or something. It looks like he will hold. And he's killed a bunch of drones here. I think he killed all of the drones. So many kills between these Marines. This is actually still anyone's game. Oh my god. I think I've called this game both ways. Like 12 times already. This makes no sense. Oh my god. I have like an entire control group of wrong calls on this game. And there's still no defense in the main. Ox are committing everything to the attack right now. Making his favorite unit. And making a Hydras instead of Lurkers. Even though he has a million and one gas. Oxerg, turn these into Lurkers, man. They're pretty good. They're pretty good units. I mean, I know you like Zerglings, but Lurkers are pretty good too. But he's going to get the final amount. Consume! Consume doesn't finish! Consume doesn't finish. He canceled Consume earlier because he thought he was going to lose it to final amount. He restarted it, but that... That drop took out the Defile Mount. There will be no consume. However, was it worth it? Was it worth that? Oh, sorry. That was Plague. Never mind. <laughs> that was Plague. He does have consume. Dark Swarm goes down. And, uh... Uh-oh. This could actually be the end. The Marine. The Marines. The Marines. They can't do anything under the Dark Swarm. But the Dark Swarm isn't quite close enough. It does range the Command Center. And morphing the Lurkers in the natural. What the heck? What the heck? Uh... Wait, he just ran past. What? Wait, what's going on? Why is he... He's morphing lurkers and the marines are just leaving. I don't understand. I don't understand. Well, the lurkers finished now. And oh god, the fire bats! The fire bats coming out, but it doesn't do anything. Oh man, is, is he just gonna win with lurkers? Is that it? Firebats! Firebats! <laughs> Firebats, man, they're pretty good. They're pretty good, and these Marines are being useless. Marines, be useful. Oh wait, look at oh, he's actually fine. Okay, never mind, he's fine. TTF is completely fine because tanks are pretty good. But he's getting mined out, though. He's almost mined out his natural, but Oxerg is mined out in his main and his natural as well. He's got only the mineral only. He's got no food, no money. He's at 40 supply against 74. Uh, this game, I don't, I don't, I'm not going to call it anymore, and oh, the dropship, dropship, uh, dropship, and more marines running out, but they have no medics, but it looks like it's going to be enough, they are 3-1 marines against, uh, two carpe zerglings, it looks like the dropship saw the lings and just, or saw the scourge rather, and just goes, goes the other direction, even though it's empty, could be a fake, uh, oh no, it's just going to fly down the other way, 